in the future, we will use, we will make usage of artificial intelligence and augmented reality um, in brain cancer imaging that ultimately will have an application on, on the surgical field scenario. So we will integrate uh, artificial intelligence for accurate image interpretation in the operating theater with augmented reality capabilities, meaning that we will use patient-specific 3D digital breast model produced with the fusion between uh, MRI 3D breast reconstruction uh, with a 3D surface scan of a patient, allowing us to see uh, in a patient-specific model of a, of a breast cancer patient where the tumor is. We can actually uh, wear and put on uh, an HoloLens headset for augmented reality, and we can see in the patient a vision like Superman, able to see the tumor inside the breast. So this capability uh, that is a non-invasive digit, non digital tool could replace standard invasive preoperative localization techniques used nowadays for breast cancer conservative surgery. Since the majority of the lesions are small because of the screening programs, uh, we, are a, we need to have preoperative localization techniques. So generally speaking, uh, a perfect scenario where artificial intelligence could improve the, the clinical outcomes of breast cancer conservative surgery is the usage of artificial intelligence for producing patient-specific 3D digital breast model that can be uploaded to a headset of augmented reality, allowing the surgeon in the operating theater to visualize where the tumor is in a digital, non-invasive, and green uh, methodology um, that, of course, will have a tremendous impact also in the patient, since as it is a non-invasive method, we will eliminate um, pain, bleeding, anxiety, and other side events, adverse side events. Um, and so that, that would be a major upgrade uh, for patients, for medical doctors, surgeons, and of course, for the healthcare systems, since we, we could avoid some procedures um, and reallocate costs where they're most needed by avoiding some of those procedures used nowadays.